this is the secret. You must remember, you can't make a mistake. Now, that's a very difficult thing to do. Because from childhood up, we have had to conform to a certain social game. And if you're going to conform to this game, you can make mistakes. Or not make Forever. mistakes. all the time. You must do the right thing. on the top of the hill know that they're nice people. But they wouldn't know they were nice people unless they had some nasty people to compare themselves with. <laughs> Every in-group requires an out-group, whereas the nasty people think they are the real far-out people, whereas those people, those hillbillies, are squares. And they wouldn't be able to feel far-out unless there were squares. See? These things simply go together. But when that is not seen, we play the games of getting on top of things all the time. And so we're in a constant state of competition as to if it's not I'm stronger than you, it's I'm wiser than you, I'm more loving than you, I'm more tolerant than you, I'm more sophisticated than you. It doesn't matter what it is, but this constant competition is going on. In terms of that competition, we can, of course, lose place and, in that sense, make mistakes. But that's their game. Now, I only say, if that game begins to bore you and it begins to trouble you and give you ulcers and uh, all kinds of things, then you raise the problem of getting out of it. And therefore, you start to become interested in things like Zen. That is simply a symptom of your growing in a certain direction. Where you are tired of playing a certain kind of game, you are as naturally flowing in another direction as if a tree were putting out a new branch. 